beautiful family welcome back to my channel happy sunday happy father's day shout out to all the dads and today we're going to talk about different lies that people can believe surrounding god and the bible so it should be pretty interesting so the belief that god never gives us more than we can handle is indeed a lie now the only way our faith will be strengthened and we will be strengthened our character and us as a person in general is through these trials and things that God wants us to face. One truth is that God never tempts us with temptations that we cannot bear. And in 1 Corinthians 10, 13, it says, No temptation has overtaken you that is not common to man. God is faithful and he will not let you be tempted beyond your ability, but with the temptation he will also provide the way of escape that you may be able to endure it. So God may give us situations and different things that may be challenging for us to handle, but the truth is he never gives us temptations that we cannot handle and he always gives us a way out. Number two, believing that your faith and your salvation is solely in the hands of a pastor or priest. Something that can commonly be misinterpreted is thinking that pastors and people of those sorts are in a higher place than us, like a higher standing and a higher, like, better relationship with God, and that is false. Yes, pastors are there to help us understand, and they have spent many years studying the Bible and different things like that, but our faith and our salvation is ultimately up to us and the time we spend aside with God. So just knowing that they are an outlet for you to help understand different things, help you, they can pray with you and different things like that, but ultimately your relationship with God comes down to you and God. Knowing that you don't need that middle man or like messenger to talk to God for you, that you are always able to talk to him whenever. The common lie that is very easy to believe is thinking that God does not have time for you. Sometimes it is very hard to believe that God has time for you with all the other crazy things going on in the world and you're just this one person. But he cares about every single little detail about you. He has time for everything. Just look at the way nature is made and how intricate the human body is. He does not spare a single detail. So trust me, he has time for you. Matthew 10, 29 through 30 says some great things. Um, are not two sparrows sold for a penny and not one of them will fall to the ground apart from your father. But even the hairs of your head are all numbered. Fear not, therefore you are of more value than any sparrows. So he literally knows, God literally knows the number of hairs on your head. That is crazy and there's so many. He's got time for you, honestly. And what I've experienced is if you feel like God doesn't have time with you or you feel distance from him, try to have him a part of your everyday life, listening to worship songs, reading the Bible, like a, a verse, just like maybe one verse a day. Like that will really help you feel more, feel closer to him. A common lie and misperception is that when you become a Christian and you've given your life to God, that everything is easy and you get everything you want, which is, it's far from that. Life doesn't get easier, but it does get better knowing that you have someone that loves you unconditionally and always someone that you can come to and is with you in every single situation. Living for God in everything you do and knowing that you're never alone. Also, the crazy... You're... You are going to go through trials and tribulations no matter what. You're going to go through loss. You're going to feel sad and all these different things. You may do things wrong... But knowing you have that person to always forgive you, that will love you no matter what you do, that makes life better. So we might not get everything we ask for. We might not have an easy, perfect life, but it is a beautiful and better life with God in it. So I hope you guys liked that video. Those are just a few of the things that are very easy to believe but are not true and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up so I know that you did. And I hope you guys had an absolutely amazing Sunday. Spend time with your fathers. And as always, I will see all your beautiful faces on Wednesday. Bye!